Welcome guys to Kingdom Come Deliverance from the Ashes DLC Part 2. We're about to travel to Rattire. That is where we're going to go. Deliver a letter to the Bailiff. And yeah, it's quite a long way though. It's, it's, it's going to take a while. But I'm up for the challenge. So let's do it. It's actually a lot of travel in it. We're pretty much in the north. We're heading to the south. So no doubt we'll have a bumpy ride, but we'll get there in one piece. And we will deliver this letter. We have arrived. Where is the bailiff? We're going to find out. Bailiff, where are you? I've got a very important note. Hey, Henry's come to see you. He has. Hello, everybody. How you doing? That pop in. I forgot about that. I am playing on PS4. I don't know why I played on PS4. No offense to console users, but I see this is almost more of a PC game. I don't know. But then again, I do gravitate naturally towards consoles. So. Right, where is the bailiff? Have a look at these cucumbers. He They'll might stay be up firm there. all winter. Buy them before. I like I've seen this guy before, but I don't remember him. So. Yeah, gotta find a way in, have a chat to him, and give him this letter. Is he in here? Bailiff, bailiff, I need your help. Is that him? I think that might be him. Bailiff, yes, found him. Right. Letter. I have a document for you from Sir Divis. It concerns the renewal of Pribislavitz. The village you drove those bandits out of? Correct. Very sane. So it's true then. Good. Good. Let me see that document then. Here it is. So what have we here? Hmm. 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 It says I should announce that anyone interested may move to Pribislavitz to live and work. And Sir Radzig and Sir Hanush also give their consent. Correct. Hmm. In that case, let's not waste any time. Come along with me. Goodbye. We're about to get a workforce, a living community in our new little hamlet. So is he doing it right now? Is he going to get up? Oh, a public announcement. Hear, hear, everybody. This is big news for us. This is big. This is very big. God. I swear he said C-U-N-T. I swear that's what he just said. I don't think he did. Stop closing the doors on me. It's so impolite and rude. So where's he going to announce this? I guess in some sort of stage, platform somewhere. Asparagus for taste and for what ails you. Oh, Try he's ringing the bell. Hear, hear, everybody. We have a very special announcement. Asparagus that'll cut you in half and a cucumber right, that'll ladies, calm down, okay. okay. Come get them. Look at the crowd. <laughs> In their hundreds. Or not. It's very quiet. Did no one hear the bell? Are you serious? Hear ye, hear ye. It is hereby announced, in the name of Sir Hanush and Sir Divish, that you, the citizens of Ratai, as well as those who have found temporary refuge here, are permitted to move to the hamlet of Pribislavitz, to the north of Tomberg Castle, wherein you shall be vouchsafed a new life and new dwellings, so providing that you shall contribute to the survive. renewal of the hamlet. All those who choose to accept this offer hey. shall be exempted from payment of careful. taxes hmm. for a period of five years. 
They shall be permitted also to make use of timber from the surrounding woods and water from the streams. The hamlet of Pribislavitz lies in the domain of Sir Divish of Talmberg, and all who settle there shall be duty-bound to him. It is furthermore hereby announced that Henry of Skalitz is appointed to the administration here? of Pribislavitz and the office of bailiff therein, which office and privilege have been conferred upon him by Sir Divish for loyalty and services here? rendered. I would therefore recommend that our Skalitz friends consider this offer very seriously, as nothing better is likely to come your way anytime soon. All right, the public announcement is done. They know what's going down. They can come over, they can work. They can improve my Hamlet, make it live, make it function, and you can live there. Sounds like a good deal to me. So what next? What do you want here? Lost in the woods is done. Completed. So my wife's brother finally paid back the dozen a place the old mate. to call home. So that, guys, is a new mission. So let's make sure we equip this mission. This quest. It's already equipped. So we have to go all the way back up north again. Okay then. Great. Let's do that. That cutscene was incredible. Look at it already. It looks so different. They've already put a lot of work into this. It's just now completely flat. We can start from scratch. Sweet. And people have arrived already. Even though I can't actually see them now. Where have they gone? <laughs> they like disappeared. Hello. I just saw a cutscene. And everyone's disappeared. It's kind of weird. <laughs> There's the church. The only thing left. So we're going to rebuild this and make it even better than it was before. A whole lot better. Okay, people are here. Good. Locator, how are you today? Hey, Henry's come to see us. Oh, this is a chest. Can I unlock it? Open. What's inside? It is empty. It is pointless. Right, so what's our next move, Locator? Welcome back. What news from Ratai? Well, the bailiff read Sir Divish's decree, and now I'm officially bailiff of Pribislavitz. Then allow me to congratulate you. What will be your first step? First, I'll, um... I'll, uh... Hmm. Actually, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> what would you recommend? As it happens... I already saw a few things in your absence. You might have noticed that the first people have come from Ratai. Yeah, I saw some heading here right away. So when they arrived, I was able to start clearing building plots with them. After they directed some temporary dwellings, that is. That's very good, isn't it? Uh, so what next? How do I choose what to build where? Um, we've got a lot of work ahead of us. Agree. What about the workers' wages? What about the workers' wages and buying materials for artisans? The money must be put in the trunk here. The expenditures for wages and materials will be taken from it. So you should keep it topped up to prevent delays. It reminds me, there's the matter of my own pay to be resolved. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, yes, of course. Sir Divish guaranteed me a fixed income. What's more, this job is an exceptionally big one. I see. How much are you thinking? I have a record of payment here somewhere. Hmm. Here it is. Let's say one quarter more than that. What? Let me try and convince him. Um, offer smaller. I can't afford that much. At least not now, right at the start. 
But I do need your help. How about this much? That's a fair yes. offer. Done. It seems we understand each other. I agree. Good. I'll put your wages in the trunk, too. Are you sure it's quite safe? Quite. Only you and I shall have a key and access to the trunk. Besides, we'll have guards on watch here. Ah, that's reassuring. That's about all to begin with. If you need any more details, I'll be happy to explain things to you. I mean, where do we start? Uh, let's start building. I want to build something. Certainly, Master Bailiff. What's it to be? Hmm. I reckon a village centre. Oh, oh my. <laughs> There's so many options. Uh, should we repair the church? A guardhouse? I think a guardhouse would be quite a good shout. Guardhouse. We need guards to protect the village and keep the peace. Exactly. And we need to build them a guardhouse. It's impossible. Check what you need in the ledger. Oh. Right, so I believe this is the ledger. Yes, it is. It, it did look quite important, didn't it? Uh, right. I need to try and make sense of this. So, we don't really have any stone grain, charcoal, livestock. We do have some glossion. And we have good reputation. Okay. Oh, what happened now? Jesus. Went crazy. Uh, so how do we actually build... So I need a bridge and road for that one. Okay, so I believe I need more money. That's basically the issue right now. Uh, just put it all in there. That's all my money now gone. For some reason I need like an obscene amount of money. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, basically, I'm going to go for a woodcutter first. Because that's the only one I can really do. Let's find it. There it is. So I can build that. I can build it, but it will cost 2,500. How am I supposed to have this much money in the game? I thought around 3,000 or something was quite good, but apparently There's not. There's work to be done. Whoops. So I've now decided what to build. No idea how long that takes. And I'm not really sure how I can go around operating this DLC. I don't know good how it's going to work. Come with me. Okay, let's do it. So I've still got, I can build this, but then what do I do next? Unless we get money... From this hamlet. I, I don't... I don't know. But woodcutter is a good place to start. Wood is very important. We've got a lot of wood around. So that's what I've gone with. But can we build any more? Like, how do I make money? If you guys have any tips on how to make very good money. I've finished the game. Uh, so I can't really do the missions as such. Uh, yeah, let me know. I've got a few things to sell. But not enough to do a building. Why are they so much money? It's just a lump of wood. <laughs> this will be our first building. Oh, exciting times. But I don't know, I'm gonna, don't know how I'm going to build more. I'm so worried. I need better. I need more income. I need some serious income. Right, we done? We in the right place? Let's start building. We're going to build here? Indeed. Can we begin? We can begin. Yes. I'm ready. I'll just quickly check again that we have everything we need. Hmm. Hmm. All good. We can start construction. There we go then. A few days later. It should be done place oh not bad why that cost me 2500 that is so much money why hey watch it watch it mate so I don't know what I can now now what do I do <laughs> I've got no money left I'm completely out. Oh, so I want to keep building so badly. So annoying. Uh, let quick look at the quests. What do you want me to do? Yeah, build a trader's house. Um, in ensure sufficient funds. 
ensure housing for the villagers, renew the church, build a trader's house. Hmm. I really need some money. Yay. Great. I swear that someone said around 3,000 was, was good enough. And you're pretty much good to go. Unless that woodcutter can make us some money. Some sort of like stable income. That could work. But uh, it, it, I don't know. If you guys have got any tips, feel free to leave them in the comments. Because I don't know what's going on right now. All I've got left is in the money I've got in here. So around 500. And that is not enough. Yeah, Woodcutter's Camp basically gives us the resources possible to repair the church, for example. But that costs 11,000. 11,000 to repair the church. How am I going to do that? I have no money. I can't do it. I think it costs at least 5,000. That's a lot of money in this game. A beehive, perhaps? Even then, I'm like... Okay. <laughs> what do I do after that? Perhaps I have to start with smaller buildings. Um, try and get some sort of income. Right, so that will conclude this episode. I will come back, hopefully. It may take me a couple of days to try and work out and get some more money. And really progress with the building. But, yeah, I basically need more money right now. So, yeah. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.